Hello, Rob from RGL Gardens here. Just a little chat on the new lawnmower blades and whether you should sharpen them or not, and my take on it. Um, quick answer, yes, <laughs> but it uh, does vary on each blade. So I'll go through a few of these blades and tell you whether I would sharpen them or not. So this is a Weebang high lift blade. That is not sharp. I've even rounded off the edge, if you can see, which is ridiculous. <laughs> so this blade, yes, I would definitely sharpen. Basically, what I'm looking for when a blade needs sharpening is if it's got a relatively pointy point, if that makes sense. It's, uh, you want it to be pointy, not rounded. So that one I definitely would. On the blade here again, it's not that sharp or pointy. And yes, you could say the the paint coating is what makes it round, but it isn't. Trust me. So yes, I'd sharpen that one. Toro blade here, and again that one's actually not too bad, but I would probably give that a little quick sharpen as well. Another Honda blade, this is actually not too bad this one. This would be one I would potentially just put on, it feels quite pointy and sharp. So I potentially would not sharpen this one, I'd just put that one on. Another Toro blade here. Again. Doesn't feel that good. So yeah, I'd sharpen that one. And that one. It's uh, very poor machining there, <laughs> but again, yeah, that one could do with a sharpen as well. How's that one? And that one. So basically, yeah, you're just looking for, it needs to be reasonably pointy. So it's actually going to cut grass and not just damage it. One thing you should always check as well with new blades, make sure they're balanced. You can get these cheap little balancing tools. You just pop your blade on and see if it's balanced. If it hangs down one way, you need to remove material from the heavy end to make it balanced. And these, I'm not overly impressed with these either, whether it's just a crap one I've got. But most of my blades don't actually fit on this properly. So it needs to be, if it's not centralised and it's not, to, you know, if it can wobble around, unless you get it bang on. It's not going to be that accurate. Yeah, these aren't that good. Most of the time, what I end up doing is just putting a hammer and a nail into the side of the bench here and then just hang on a nail and then see whether it pivots. But yeah, always check your blades when you get them new, make sure they're balanced. You don't need to be putting any uh, undue wear on the spindles or bearings. <laughs> 